Hey everybody, how you doing? I've been putting this one off for a very long time. Um, I've had this for a while, hanging out in my fridge. And yeah, I'm terrified of it. This is uh, Sent to Me by Tony Sherwood. Um, this was, I believe, originally uh, originally introduced uh, by Judy over at pepperlover.com and uh, developed uh, by her. Now, uh, this was grown by Tony Sherwood and sent to me. Um, and I've, I've seen this kick everyone's ass. This really needs no introduction. This is the Brown Maruga Scorpion. It's got that nice kind of rose-like shape that you typically see uh, in Marugas. It's got a little greenish right there and it's a little sucked in tail. Uh, and it's got this nice kind of light, like milk chocolate brown. It's got a strong aroma, like you can smell this all the way through the skin. Like beautiful shape, beautiful looking pepper. Um, and I'm terrified, terrified to try this. But we gotta do it. So I am gonna cut this open. We can get a look at the guts of this fearsome creature. Oh no. Oh boy, does that smell strong. Give you guys a look at what I'm seeing here. Uh, now, it's got a placenta uh, and a layout inside that's similar you know, to what you'd see in a red maruga. However, uh, that placenta is a deep red to a dark brown. Um, whenever I see discoloration in a placenta like that, I get terrified. Now, similar to the red maruga, there's a lot of seeds that just kind of line up like there are a shark's row of teeth right there. Uh, and also placental tissue lines the inner wall. And you can see right there, uh, there are just pools of oil everywhere. Uh, and that blade, when that came away from this, that did not look happy. And that's got an extremely potent aroma. <clears throat> oh, that's not good. Pulled the stem out, managed to pull out some placenta as well. So I uh, guess we know which part I'm eating first. <laughs> My clumsy ass. All right, let's get this shit going, shall we? Flavor is not bad. It's got that fruity scorpion flavor. Some earthiness. I can already tell I'm in for a bad time. A slight floral undertone to it.
Nothing too major though. Okay, right now it's an all over mouth burn. And it's building. I grab it in my throat right here. It's hot and it's definitely building but if this is as bad as it gets I'm gonna be very very disappointed Yeah, burn is um, all over mouth burn. Strong tongue burn underneath the tongue, gums, roof of mouth. It's not really getting the cheeks too bad. Um, throat right here. But yeah. I was expecting far worse than this. And uh, right now it's a slow build. I'd heard that uh, these burn violently, um, but yeah, this isn't doing that for me. Kind of an all over even heat. There's nothing too violent about it. Flavors fruity, earthy, slightly floral, not unpleasant. Not a fantastic flavor either, um, but definitely not unpleasant. And um, yeah. It's just kind of lingering around. Not really building, not really pounding me like I was expecting it to. Not that I can't say I'm not thrilled to receive a reprieve here, but it's um, it's not destroying me like I thought it would. Uh, so. Sometimes this happens, fellas and ladies. Uh, sometimes you get a dud. Um, and while this is definitely hot, 
I definitely compare this uh, to other, you know, it's definitely in the super hot range. Uh, this is not the monster I've been led to believe it is. It's, um, it's pretty tame. There is nothing that fearsome about this. Um, I may at some point revisit this one, try and go back and, uh, and eat another, but, uh, let's just say, uh, I was expecting Jason Voorhees and I got Dennis the Menace instead. A little irritating, but not a killer. So I um, want to thank uh, Tony Sherwood again for sending me this. Um, this one, I mean, a flavor, I'm going to give it, uh, hmm, you know, it's about, about on par for you know, chocolate super hots. I'd give it about a seven. Um, heat, I'm going to give that one about a seven as well. Uh, I was expecting to be blown away, but instead, uh, my experience has been thoroughly unremarkable. Um, yeah, I eat another one, that'll change, but this one, yeah, nowhere near as fearsome as it looked. All right, if you enjoyed this video, please like, uh, comment, subscribe, share it with your friends, and uh, I will be back with more. Thank you.